organ in our body, able to coordinate memories, thoughts, feelings, and emotions. The research and invention in the field of neuroscience have sparked a curiosity within us. So, today we will discuss how the Blue Brain Project can contribute much to the field of neuroscience. IBM, in collaboration with the EPFL Brain and Mind Institute in Switzerland, aims to create a digital reconstruction of a rat brain, which will eventually lead to the digital reconstruction of a human brain. Blue Brain is the world's first virtual brain. A virtual brain is a digital replica of the brain. In Blue Brain technology, the virtual brain, stored in numerous chips, will reside in a supercomputer called Blue Gene. It will be able to think, take decisions, react, and keep things in memory. There are about 86 billion neurons in our brain. Neurons are the cells that make up our brain. When we think, the neurons communicate with each other by sending electrical and chemical signals. Blue Brain Project researches how human beings think and remember things. When the contents of a human brain is uploaded to Blue Brain, his or her intelligence, knowledge, and skills will be kept forever. The uploading is possible using small robots known as nanobots. They can travel throughout our circulatory system and reach the brain. Nanobots can carefully scan the structure of the brain. The collected information about billions of neurons is then uploaded into the supercomputer blue gene. This could function as a virtual human brain. In 2017, Henry Wagra, director of the Blue Brain Project, announced that they have discovered a universe of multidimensional structures and shapes within the networks of the brain. There were structures up to 11 dimensions. They assumed that memory was kept within these multidimensional cavities. They released the first digital 3D brain cell atlas in 2018. Scientists think that memory loss could be cured by installing blue brain chips within the brain. Also, by keeping a person's intelligence in a blue brain, it can be utilized even after a person's death. There exist fears of human cloning. But in the not so distant future, artificial replicas of the human brain will be created. And that will be the beginning of many changes in our society. Hope you liked the video. Subscribe if you are new before you leave. And stay tuned for our next video.